So we love to have local authors. It means people who know them can come in and buy their book and they're delighted. The local authors come in and they'll sign their books. That makes them special for somebody then. So, well, I mean, you know that Hazel comes in all the time. She signs the books all the time for us. Um, we had, um, let me see who else comes in. Oh, we have Juanita Brown's book. She lives in Calverstown. It's book of the first, my first book of Irish animals, and it's a gorgeous book. I just think it's lovely. If I if I didn't know where she lived or who she was, I'd still stock it. It's a great book. We have um, Anne Macmillan's Heather in Summer. Um, she lives in the Market Square. She's a lovely lady. Again, she came in and signed all her books. She, she's a customer, so she comes in all the time, and and she's just lovely. Um, it's a pleasure to sell books to people for when you know the people. It's easier to sell the books, I think. You know, you have more confidence in um, standing behind them and, you know, actually selling the books. Yes. The most recent one is the local history of the Ballymore GAA. So Henry Murphy came in last week and dropped us in some of them, so we're delighted to have that. Um, now, it's massive. It took him six years to write. But for anybody who has any interest in Ballymore GAA, it's, it's a brilliant, especially brilliant Christmas present. I think it's that kind of a book. Um, it's well worth seeing. We have them here if people want to come in, even just to have a look at it. Um, we have a book about Maura Laverty, who lived, she's from, she was from Rathangan. She wrote cookbooks. She wrote on Talker Road. She's a really interesting woman, but the man who wrote that uh, lives in Lake Slip, but he's from Rathangan originally. Again, he just rang up and said, is there any chance of you stocking the book? And we were delighted because it's something that people are interested in and it's something that you can't get everywhere. So it's a, kind of a different present for, you know, in, often now you can get everything everywhere and it's hard to get something that's a little bit different and that people don't already have. Um, what else do we have? We have a book about Joseph Locke. Again, the lady who wrote it contacted us directly, dropped the books in herself and signed them. Um, she thought we might be interested in them because he lived in Salins for a while, so she thought it might be a local interest. And she told us it's an interesting story anyway, that he, he led a very interesting life, that people might be interested from that point of view. Um, the 9 to 12 bookshelf down there is one of the most popular ones at the moment with the young adult books. Tangleweed and Brian, I think, is the most popular one at the moment. Yeah, it's a young adult. And uh, Beyond the Sky, that's yeah. the one, yeah. So I think that one for young lads, I think that's more interesting. They're more interested in that one. We also have um, a book by Niall Power, who grew up on the Curra. Um, it's called Timing is Everything. He was a drummer for Bob Geldof. Uh, well, he was a drummer for lots of um, big band, big famous bands. Um, he was actually on Nationwide last week but he developed Parkinson's so he uh, can't drum anymore. So it's just a story of his experiences when he was um, a rock and roll star and now what it's like now. So it's a really interesting book as well.